I was, but I think what we were doing is hanging out with Sid, trying to find the another fire dominant. Whoever might be the one that does Phoenix. Do the map. <clears throat> so yeah, we were at the forest. We killed the giant salamander, Fefnir, if I think so is correct. And ooh, you know, I never actually looked at the map. So these are the major kingdoms. You can tell because they have they all have a crystal next to them. Except for this one. Dude, there's no kingdom here. There's a kingdom here, but... Hmm. There's a giant hole in the ground. Alright then. Let's go ahead and uh, I guess go to... Orab uh, Orabe Downs. I dig planes that stretch across the southern reaches of the Holy Empire as sparsely popular on this... One knows where to look. <clears throat> dun, dun, dun. I am severely enjoying this game. It's, I, I like the way the combat seems to be evolving. Can't wait to see what they do for the next outing, but sometime later. I like how I can just go back and forth. The Holy Empire of Sunbreak. So much for arriving before sunset. Huh. I didn't realize we were this close. Yeah, took a detour. Any Fine. idea what that is they built the village around? The Fallen Ruin. I've heard some call it an airship. Ooh. Though its flying days seem to be behind it. Oh. Oh, we all oh, said you're going to be flying that, don't you worry. You truly think a dominance waiting for us in that village? My scout has never given me any reason to doubt him. Which is why I think we should hurry. Come on. <clears throat> Oh, what is that? That was the thing on the map. That's the uh, obelisk. Tuning with an obelisk allows Clive to travel quickly to locations via both the world map and local map. Clive only need to approach an obelisk to a tomb of it. Ah, okay. So we turned it on. Louder than words. Louder than words. Ah! Dun, 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 dun. Oh man, you damn you zooming. Okay. Okay, so I can. Okay, yeah, I can just fast travel there. What do we got going on here, though? Got a potion. What the? Woodhound. Would he attack me? Maybe. <laughs> It's over. Oh, right. I, I got dog commands. And I got bloody hides. I think I got some money. This is like a really nice place. So we have some festival wolves, although this is a weird. But I guess wolves do come out at night. Oh, I can just go through these. What are they growing here? These are vines. No, I thought they were vines. They're tiny trees. Figures up ahead. But are they friends or foes? Mmm. They go see if they want to be friends. Maybe they want to be friends. They're like, hey, you guys want to have friends? We're here looking for the fire dude. <laughs> Oh, down boy. They're all dead. All right, I guess we're gonna have to go interact with those guys. We can explore this. Hmm. Even when people hear there's suspicious amounts of wolves or wood hounds. Silver Lobo. Come on, say, do I have to do everything here for you? Hey!
All right, let's go confront those lovely gentlemen down there. See what they uh, see what they're doing here. See what they're doing here in this ideal like, little countryside. I like how he just jumps over fences by himself. Royal. Oh shit. To ask the next ones we meet. Let me know how it goes. What was this though? A little different path this way. Just leads to nowhere. All right. <clears throat> Wait, does he heal heal himself or does he heal us? Oh, those are flowers. Never mind. I thought it was an item. Question, destination. Well, yeah, it's right here. Lost Wing, the Holy Empire of St. Borak. Oh, shit, they actually did build their village into the remains of this thing. Damn, I thought we were going to fly this thing, but, you know. No sign of the royalists. Or anyone else for that matter. Yeah, it's way too quiet. What's going on here? Quiet, even for this hour. What do we do now? First we look for my scout. You start here, I'll circle around the back. How do I let you know if I find him? Good question. Yeah, you'll figure Shout. it out. <laughs> Fucking yell. Yeah. Yeah, you don't need to know. You'll be fine. These are all blocked off. There's... The village can't be completely abandoned, can it? it? Might there's this dude over here? Oh, that's it. You miss me? I'm flattered, but let's stick to the plan, eh? Fine, fine. Oh, what's this? Oh. <laughs> Hello, any scout dude? Anyone here? Hello? <laughs> that sounds like a child. That is a child. Child, it's, why are you crying? It's only at night. Stop it. You're gonna wake up people. It's alright. I'm not one of them. My friend and I, we're... with the Imperial Army. And we've come to help. Do you know where your parents are? In... In the church. The I church. need to find them and make sure they're safe. Can you stay hidden here until then? To the church then. Hmm, I'm sure I like where this is going. Oh, hey, Sid, did you also find the church? The church, I know. I'm one step ahead of you. You go in through the front, I'll take the rear. Anyone stands in our way, the other can stand in the back. I like I like the way you think, uh, Sid. Real good. Oh, that's hot for now. I like it saying, yeah, we'll go in one to the front, one to the back. That way, if someone's in trouble, the other one can just stab the person in the, in the back. There's no one here. The pews are empty. Are you praying to Jesus? Are you down there, Jesus? Oh. Oh, I think they're treating someone. I thought they were, like, ravaging someone. I was like, what the fuck is happening here? Sorry. 
This man's gonna die if we don't get into a healer. Enough of your barking, dog! And there he goes. About time. That's a scout, is he? Stand back. Yeah, I honestly don't think it's too hard to... I don't think you need magic to break down this door. I mean, look at it. It's just wood and flimsy and all that. Hell are you? That's the signal. <laughs> Thought you weren't coming. You still alive, Gav? <laughs> Barely. Been doing what I can for the villagers, but... I thought you were joking. It's all right. He's with me. Is this everyone? No. There were others. A pair of royalists came for the bearers just before you arrived. Was a dominant among them? Maybe. It's not like he was holding a sign. Dominant. Just big old sign. Dominant. Uh oh. Oh, shit. I'll give you one guess where he's going. Oh, well, good job letting that happen. Oh, okay, there you go. But so you just gonna let him run off? Yeah, I would be looking into, honestly. I'm like, nope, gotta, gotta let my friends know. Pursue the fleeing soldier. Yeah, I'm. Oh, man, that guy can run. All that metal, and that guy can run. He can fucking book it. Though I'm pretty sure I'm drawing it. Although I. <laughs> he said, we gotta go, we gotta go. There's only two of them, gotta get my friends. <laughs> Any word from the scouts? Oh, it's not yet, my lady. But we have the dominance companion. It's only a matter of time before we seize our quarry. Very good. And what of the others? Yeah, I should have. I should have uh, run into her. Those have been taken to care no event. <laughs> Some may still be worth keeping, should the dominant elude us. All is in hand, my lady. They will not be spoiled. I give you my word. <laughs> Gentlemen, a toast! Will you join me? <laughs> my thanks. To our lady of the wind. And the king! Mm. <laughs> oh, the Imperials drink this piss? Well, it would go some way to explain their breath. <laughs> uh, before box wine, there was sack wine. Imperials. Uh oh, Ty Clive, now it's your turn to run away. And instead of killing them, you lead the rat straight to us. Mercy. <laughs> God, you're such a bitch. Look what we have here, boys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I led the Imperial one dude to like a group. Oh, how dare you? I'm gonna have to kill you now. I was getting bored. Oh. Okay. Well, that's not. Mm. Boo. Oh. Oh shit, that actually almost impaled, like, it just impaled you. <clears throat> Wait, uh, come on, I. You... Oh. Who are you? Where did. Yeah, what is. Sharada? What is that thing? Sid has some explaining to do. Okay, cool. Who's Throw some magic in my way, but... Actually, that might be it. Oh, I miss! Oh, 
Ugh. Always forget about that follow. -up. There you go. Keep your distance, boy. A little help. There you go. Shit, shit out of us. Man. You're right. I'm more like shit. Nothing. Get out of here. Get out of here. Ah. Ooh, wait, I got an Italian. He gets magic damage. You've got some fight in you, even for a branded. <sighs> My comrades, are... ah, I gotta figure out how to how to actually hold and, and do attack at the same time. <laughs> Look who's here to save the day. It's Sid. Is this how you recruit all of your charges? Don't recall you complaining, Benedicta. Ooh, they know each other. So, Sidolphus. Oh, he, your My name is Sidolphus? Why was it that you betrayed your kingdom? I asked you a question, Lord Commander. Why? Because I'd had enough of you and your king's antics. And yet here you are, stealing my branded. Your branded? What are you plotting? As if I'd tell you. Lady Benedicta, we have secured the dominant. Holy <sighs> son. I'm not sure you should have shouted that out. Oh hmm, well. Now we know they have the dominant. Now we gotta go after them. And she's gone. Did she say where she was going? No. Then we head back to Lost Wing. One of the villagers may have heard something. No, oh, damn, it, just, which you're pretty... is why I sent Gav. The man has a nose for these things. Trust See, he's actually pretty smart about all this. I like how Clyde was just ready to go chase after nothing, basically, just run into the fucking woods, and he's like, no, nah, no, nah, did she say anything at all about where she's going? Like, no. Then we head back and see if they have villagers or anything. But we can't let her. Like, That's why I sent Gav, my scout, because he, he's good at what he does. I like so, that. It's, it's really, it wasn't really smart. There is at all. They were looking for a dominant. Yeah, that's right. I thought we were hiding the bastard. Fuck any of us would keep a monster like that under our roof. Oh, no offense. When no one talked, they started rounding up everyone with a brand. And then everyone without one and all. And locked you in the cellar, hoping sooner or later someone would break. You know, things might have been different if you'd accepted my invitation. Oh, don't remind us. We were all saying the same thing. It's our own, innit? Don't mean we won't out when we can, though. And that, I'll drink to. Oh, so... You see, these are all free people, then. So is that what's going on? <clears throat> oh, boy. Old timey songs. Let's go. Uh, going to a bar, getting drunk, and just being merry. Ah, that's a lot. Oh, 
Listen, Clyde. <laughs> Revenge won't bring him back. It won't. Thirteen years ago, I watched a dominant kill my brother right in front of me. And I did nothing. But now I can. I can kill the son of a bitch. And bring peace to my brother's soul. Hmm. After that. Bring peace. Whatever happens. Bring to peace me. to your brother's soul or yours? Which is it, Clive? Right. You're content to be a slave then. God, I would. What I would do to go up and like that. Meanwhile, at the Fortress of Injustice. Care Norvant. This radiance would have us believe the Imperial host invincible. <clears throat> Yet here we find the Empire's cornerstone teetering on the backs of a handful of cowards and cutthroats. <laughs> so which dominant are you? Well, Bahamut may lead Ooh. a hundred full legions. Bahamut! Could it be that the young prince defends a house of cards ready to topple at the slightest breeze? No, he this. This guy has Bahamut. Tell me something. Why do you not resist? Within you lies the power to slay gods. The phoenix perished in your flames. No. Yet you do not fight. Ifrit? You do not flee. You refuse your gift. Perhaps you are distracted. My offer still stands. Join us, and you will be treated with the respect one of our kind deserves. Ooh. Damn. I thought she was just gonna, you know, like point, not even just go straight into it. Lord Mondrace, don't. Uh, I don't think we're gonna be able to save her the way things are going. I'll give you a moment to consider <laughs> your options. Do be gentle with them. I'm okay, so I'm really so kind of psyched up to go see uh, to see Bahama. I want to see what he looks like in this game. Clive. Wake up. Gav's back. Man, were you just sitting, sleeping at the bar? You couldn't even find like a room or something? Hell, go outside and sit on a bench. Just literally fall asleep on the bar. Ken Orvent. One of the Empire's outlying strongholds. Though apparently not strong enough to keep out the Royalists. The captured bearers are inside. I'm sure of it. If Benedicta's orders are to stay in the shadows, she won't be traveling with many men. Meaning, she'll be keeping her prisoners together and close by. Including the Dominant. So, we find a way into the fortress and conjure a bit of chaos. Uh, what about me? You wanna, you wanna raid a fortress? Excellent question, Gav. You will wait outside the care and guide those I free to safety. And miss all the fun? Why can't he do that? <laughs> Clive doesn't have your nose. He'd stumble off a cliff before he even found the men. Come on, Gav. You're the best man for the job. Well, when you put it that way, <laughs> I like that. I, better scout I like so. surprises. <clears throat> Don't you let him down. I'm liking Sid more and more. I won't. Right. Shall we? Not so fast. We wait until tomorrow. But he's right there. And if we leave now. Will arrive just as the sun comes up. Maybe join the guards in breaking their fast. Come on, Clive. 
They only just took the place. They'll be there a while yet. Yeah, Clive is like... We've got one hmm. chance at this. You don't want to waste it. Do you? No. He said, I think it's good for us to rest as well. You know, we, uh, you just slept at a bar. It might be, you know, best to actually get some proper rest. God, Sid is really smart of this. Like, Clive is just the typical, like, young, hot-headed hero. And Sid is just like, don't, don't be like that. Stop it. The dead of night. Uh, the story progress new weapon signs will be available at the Hideaway's trading post sharing uh sharing as new foreign version black hammer. No, that's settled. There's someone I want you to meet. Hello? At this hour. He's the owner of the tavern, and our best hope of getting a decent night's kip. Uh, oh. Let's see. So I can actually travel back to get better weapons and stuff if I wanted to. I got another... Uh, can I actually use... Hmm. Oh no, they're telling me what slots equipped. Okay. Cleric's medallion. Uh, healing pitching by 20%. Uh, timely assistance, timely... Okay, the timely ones I don't... I am at 698. I want to get this one and then start leveling up the other ones. Quest destination nearby. Hmm. You're the kind man who saved mommy. Oh, look at that. Thank you. You're welcome. That'll be 20 gold, please. <clears throat> what can I interest you in today? The long sword, which it's already been up. They upgraded wolf skin again. Mm -hmm. I could probably update one of the. Uh... Oh, I can buy stuff. Interesting. Yo, what is this? I also the Empire or orchestration rule. Change up a parchment home which has uh, hastily scrolled several bars of music and. Oh, is, uh, okay. This adds song. Why is it so expensive just for a soundtrack though? Like Jesus. I don't want to sell any of this stuff. Okay. All right, let me see if I can head back and I can upgrade some stuff back at the old place. So I can just come back here. I'm not even sure. That, well, I know there's a smithy here. I'm not, I don't know if there's a smithy in the other place, so... Make it quick. So, what would it be? Uh. Wolfskin sash. Nah. Because this is a plus one. Mm. Where's the compare? Yeah, I got the deuce. Alright, let's uh, reinforce. Do, 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 do. I need. Oh, I don't have a meter. Metro. Yeah, yeah. I need one meteorite. Do I not have that? Anything else? At least I can buy it. Cause I no, I don't think that guy was offering meteorite. And what do you want? If you're gonna buy some, be quick about it. Is that okay. all? Yeah, she doesn't sound. All right, so we're going back then. I keep hitting the wrong button. Magic for light. Oi, how about some light over here? It's black as Odin's bum hole. Speak with Quinton. Oh, you're Quinton. I thought you were inside the. Hmm. Here, I thought you were inside the bar this whole time. Yeah, I don't know. Let me see the merchant. I think. Did you have, actually. You haven't much, but you're free to look. Consumables, materials. Yeah, he does have a meteorite. Cost a thousand. 
Oh, yes. Mm, I feel like the money system is a little kind of all, like all over the place. Or, well, I feel like they're way more expensive than I think they should be. But I, don't know. <clears throat> but I can't. That means I can go up and upgrade the uh, my defenses a bit more. Looks like the this place is still locked out. I think that's Quinton. All right, let's go ahead and upgrade that thing before getting. We'll go talk to Quinton real fast. I'm surprised Charon doesn't actually have a uh, materials crafting materials for sale. The villagers of Lost Wake are sympathetic to our cause. They'll help us. Don't worry. Yeah, I gotta get that vibe from them. Although I'm kind of confused with the Royalists here. and then there's the Imperialists. Like, two different kingdom groups that are hard to keep track of. Mmm, get that HP back up. Yeah, that should do you. Awesome. Let's go. Let's go talk to Quentin. Who in and where are you? Hmm. So it said I should go say hello. Quintin, my good man. It seems we'll be spending the night. I the male version of so. Quintus. Where do you find that one? Well, oh, him. You won't believe me if I told you. I was in the middle of the battlefield. An old friend. One who is sympathetic to our cause. Feels like there's a lot of passes there. And he knows about your little sanctuary. I would never have guessed so many people were bent on setting us free. When last I checked, the mere thought would only a trip to the gallows. I am well aware of the risks, as I am of the rewards. Oh, high risk, high reward kind of fellow, are you? And what could be more rewarding than your very own dominant of fire? A dominant? Here? Now that I would like to see. Mm, I feel like... Meaning you haven't. <clears throat> no, but nothing passes unnoticed in Lost Wing. Take your brand, for example. I mean, it's not hard to miss. People will see that at once. And I need hardly tell you how they will greet the inquiries of a bearer. You are afraid your words will fall on deaf ears. As they have ever since the moment you were marked. Hmm. He's got you pegged down, Clive. I can provide a solution to your dilemma. As a favor to Sid, that is. Take this. You will find it has the uncanny power to loosen tongues. Is it money? Seal obtained. You have a. You accept the hanged man from Quint. What? May the mothers guide you. Wait, what did I just get? Are we playing? Are we playing hangman? This might be imperial land. <clears throat> Here in Lost Wing, it's his word that's law. But how? You don't need to worry about that just yet. Trust me, everyone in Lost Wing knows what that seal means, and what it means if they don't take note. Now we can sit here counting our blessings, or put them to good use and find that dominance. Your choice. So what, do I just wear that on my suit like a badge? Saying, Clive, I'm here, I need some answers. Why don't I talk to you? Let's oh, see if this thing really works. The hangman. Alright, let's go talk to some people, I guess. See if they'll take a uh, notice of my fancy badge. But I have it on me, though. I was, I was... Uh, the seal marks the bearer's trusted ally of the Quint Quintin of Lost Wing. And I believe I can provide a solution to your. Oh, okay. Hmm. 
Woodcutter. Ah. What you got for me, Woodcutter? Master Quinton took a lark into you, I see. And there I was, thinking you were in bed with Sid. What? Wonder what Gav will have to say about this. Speaking of whom, if you see him, tell him thanks for looking after us. Now, what can I help you with? I'm searching for a dominant of fire. Gav seems to think <clears throat> he might have taken refuge here. We see a lot of bearers around these parts. But I do seem to recall one who commanded the flame. Now, whether or not that makes him a dominant, I can't say. But the Waludas certainly took a keen interest in the poor sod. Well, Did you even look at him? Didn't have a chance. One of the other bearers might have died. Thank you. Man, I'm starting to get a little bit mixed up. I feel like they should have shown something besides royalist and imperialist. It's a little bit too close to each other. I mean, the, the journal should have something, right? No, I see. Uh, I think those requests are done. Here's. There was supposed to be like a journal option that gives you a. No, I don't see it. Oh, well. it's supposed to give you something, tell you something about the story, but. Ma'am, do you know where the dominant fire is? The dominant. That a hanged man, I see. Yes. Would you like Master a closer look? It must think you're important. It was a good thing you done today, getting rid of those bastards. If you hadn't come when you did, I'd be on my way to Ash by now, along with the others. Poor buggers. These others, was there a dominant among them? A dominant of fire? Might have been, yeah. Royalists seem to think there was, anyhow. A thin bloke all swallowed up in his robes like one of great Grieger's churchmen. Do you recall anything else about him? Only that you weren't alone. It was a young maid who went wherever he did, including the church. And wherever the royalists dragged them both off to before you got here. I see. Thank you. I wonder if Sid's found anything. You got some info, let's go. Sid, where are you? We go take you got enough men, we can go take a nap. Then we can go head out tomorrow morning. The hanged man is always watching. <laughs> As if he had aught better to do. Alright. Sounds like a alright. What you got, Sid? Here's what Tell I got. Tell me that scowl means you've got good news. <clears throat> Maybe what's it to you? What's it to you, huh? So a shady lad with a hood. And he's equally shady, lass. Not much to go on. Uh, it's better than nothing, sir. But... I've been thinking, if our friend is a dominant, why not just burn the royalists to a crisp? There's a reason he's holding back, and I reckon he has something to do with his partner. What makes you say that? One of the villagers I talked to said the two were separated. If the Waludas have her, our dominants like to think twice before starting any fires. Whoever he is, he's shown himself to have a level head. He's careful, cunning, and he doesn't want to be found. Mm. This could spell trouble. For us and the Royalists both. <clears throat> Still, it'll be a whole lot worse if we set off after them with bleary eyes and empty bellies. There should be a pair of pallets waiting for us back at the inn. Shall we? Oh, thank God, yes. I am exhausted. those beds beds i seem to recall your request being to spend the night and for that Oof. the floor will more than suffice damn are you gonna play us like that i suppose <sighs> my thanks quinton next time you're at the hideaway our floor's all yours <laughs> no need for thanks sid this isn't an act of charity you don't say in exchange for my floor 
I shall be requiring your services. Oh, come on, Clinton. The royalists saw fit to erect a barricade across the road south when they occupied the village and failed to remove it when they left. I expect it to be gone before you leave. As you wish. Man, you could at least give him some beds before, uh, for doing that. Instead of just the floor. Come on, man. The following evening. God, Quentin's such a hard ass. Well, that took longer than expected. First time dismantling the barricade. It gets easier, don't worry. I won't. If we leave now, we'll arrive at the care when the shadows are at the deepest. Unless you'd rather wait. No more waiting. Yeah, let's go. Let's right, go storm yeah, fort. Unless I know of another shortcut, you should be so lucky. Can I go through here. Yeah, let's go. Uh, where is it? Huh? Where is this lead to? Anyway, I guess we're gonna explore this. The mystery of vinification. While some uh, winemakers have removed the skin of the grape after pressing, leaving both skin and seeds and the juice to come, uh, come in, I think it's congeal, creates a, mo uh, a must that is better suited for extended aging, ultimately resulting in more refined wine. Then, once the uh, wine calms and settles sufficiently, the skins are removed and the, and the must is then uh, transferred to wooden barrels of oak and chestnut, which, by allowing air to leach into the wine, imparts the Deepen levels of complexity, introducing rich aromas and improving texture, all with lessening bitterness. <laughs> huh. Weird. They're kind of right about the winemaking. Not sure why they're so correct about it, though. But okay. I didn't say kind of, because I'm not, you know, an expert. Hello. Nothing down here but dust and cobwebs. Unless you really help me get rid of them. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, sorry, ma'am. I'm afraid we're are a little busy right now. Maybe next time. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Come on, let's go. So if I keep going straight, I should hit the cellar thing. No. Oh, right. There's. The jump is uh, not much. I guess that all that all that type of combat's really not much. Appreciate your out with the Royalists barricade earlier. We'll see you the rest. Yeah, no problem. We out. Is that? Wait, what's going on? I'm like having trouble look. Ugh. Okay, so yeah, this gets me here. Oh, god damn it. So I, I, I was following that though, and then it didn't lead me to the uh. Oh, this, this little map is kind of hard to read. It's like a generalized map, it doesn't actually show everything. Connected, disconnected. So if I go this way, like I'm trying to check out that cellar, but I actually can't find it because the map is not really showing me what I want to see. Ooh, more hides. Hello. Most of us came to Lost Wing to get away from the kind of thing that happened last night. <clears throat> oh, which only makes it worse. Oh, sorry to hear about that. Don't you worry. We chased them away. We shouldn't be back. Okay, look. So if I go here. I should be able to go this way. But no, it wants me to go to the top. The problem is that when I was at the top already, it didn't really let me do that. Like, look, let's say, let's try that again. Okay, we go up this way. We're crossing. Uh, 
According to this, the cellar should be like right over here. But I can't go any further forward. So it has to be under something else. Which I would like to explore, but I can't because I can't. the map is just all the levels glued together on top of each other. Which doesn't really help. Alright, so I... Yeah, see what I mean? I, I don't like the way this map is set up. So that means there's something underneath that runs along all this or something? Because, <clears throat> look, there... There's this right there. And it's just supposed to be into this blob that just leads here. But there's supposed to be a cellar here. Oh, you know what it is? Okay, I see this is what I mean. It's actually this part right here, and it goes all the way down to this spot. Ugh. That's not that's not the best kind of map design. You take you've taken all the levels and basically put them on the same plane. Babe. Back to me, my darling. I can't bear another night without you. Ooh, what's going on here? You two go back to bed. Whatever, we're gonna go ahead and out. What you got? The road here cuts through Lorbert's Pass to Cairn Northern. You're not thinking of heading that way, are you? If the Royalists were looking to take the care that have posted centuries to prevent any unwelcome surprises, at least I would have. Sanctuaries. Well, you should know. What's it mean by sanctuaries? Yeah, the stabbing with the sword is kind of, but just close range shooting fire into that is just kind of insane to me. Temporarily. Well, you don't think they're acting on a whim, do you? This is one of His Majesty's cunning stunts, and he sent his best to execute it. Yo, check out the, this open spool, nice little river. I wonder if this game has fishing. Look at that beautiful lake. No, that's a river. That is a beaut. Oh, I saw a fish. I saw a fish. Please tell me. I hope that you get this game lets you fish later on. The one thing I gotta do say, I kind of miss the being able to control multiple party members. You know. Yeah, Hard not to crack even when it isn't crawling with royalists. I don't care who else is in there. Thing is, 
I think the best they could do was just give you different abilities for the main characters to make him feel different. That way he doesn't feel like you're controlling one. Keep your distance, boy. Ooh. Ow. Oh, I did that. Ah, uh, I did that because I thought he was about to shoot me in the face with that. Really hoping for a counter. <clears throat> see, we got another counter here. I want to see what's over here, and then we got to go across the bridge. But it's all a huge section. <clears throat> ah, they're guarding the bridge, all right. Much as I enjoy battering down the front door, I hazard this endeavor will require a bit more tact. There's an old sluice that empties under the bridge. It should see us through to the lower levels of the care. Sid. Oh, we're gonna go through the sewers, huh? We both know why I'm here. But what is it that you want? Why would you risk your life for a handful of outcasts? If anyone ever learned what you've been doing with their property... They have my head in a box. But this isn't just about dominance and bearers, it's about all of us. What I want is to build a place where it doesn't matter what you are. But who you are. Mm, how noble of you, Sid. <laughs> but our world isn't ready for a place like that. So, until it is, I use the power I've been given to show people there is hope. Mmm, hand. Sneaky, sneaky, sneak. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. They keep adding more guards to the fucking bridge. So, tell me about this, Benedicta. The best and worst decision I ever made. Ah, two for one package. Nice. Don't underestimate her, Clive. A fight with her icon is not one you're likely to walk away from. Garuda. Warden of the Wind. Hey. Mm -hmm. God, these patrols suck. The fact that they, at one point they all just start walking in the same direction. Instead of keeping going back and forth, back and forth, like they effing should. See, this is what happens when you don't hire good help. This is what happens when you don't hire good help. They let you down with little mistakes like this. Ooh. Care no no event. I like her nail color. It matches. It, it really feels like it goes with the rest of her outfit. You know what? It's the blonde hair. It matches. It goes with the hair. That color. <clears throat> the land has fallen. The eastern territories all but belong to the orcs. I'll have my men ready to depart by noon. Don't bother. But what of the mines? Without adamantite, the blight would have engulfed the mines ere long. Besides, you already have your orders. Yes, my liege. Ah, oh, she would be the seen. Dark the dark swallows more the of the realm with each passing day. The land starved of the ether that gives it life. And as the fringes fade, the people flock to the mother crystals, desperate for their blessing. The war we wage for possession of that blessing, it breaks us from within. Hastening us to our own destruction. And so you do what must be done. 
I unite the dominance, hmm. that we may bring an end to the strife and found a new order to see us unto tomorrow. Under your the world order. must be restored, and I will see it so. You might have already had Sidolphus not betrayed us. Him again. Lust you still for his embrace? Yeah, don't talk what? about another man while in bed. Of course not. Then don't bring up your ex-boyfriends while you're in bed with your man. I serve you and you alone. Oh, that side booba. I remember well <coughs> the day you first entered these halls. Your pale hand pressed into his as if it would never let go. That... That was a long time ago. See, this is what happens when you bring up your ex-boyfriend. It just ruins the mood. It's the only hand I need. Just now, grab that face and squeeze. And always. Soon, my dear. Soon all will know whose hand it is that keeps them from falling into the darkness. Hold me, my leash. Never let me go. I need to see this guy in like armor because he doesn't seem all that imposing at the moment, but that's because he's butt naked. <clears throat> what the one of our sentries has failed to report, my lady. Your orders. Pull the men back inside the care cave. <clears throat> he is here then. Have them lead Sid and his little pet to the chapel. I shall entertain them there. <sighs> I wonder if I can block that uh, Chidara's uh, big uh, magic wind ball if I counter. Care Nova Norvent. 